In the last Facebook Pixel tutorial I created, I showed you how to create a new Facebook Pixel for your Facebook ad. Before now, all you needed to do to create your new Pixel is to sign into your business account at business.facebook.com, come to All Tools, Settings, then you will come to Data Source and then click Pixel. So, before now, you can create your new pixel from this point. But now, as you can see, this hard button has been disabled and you can no longer create a new pixel from this point. What Facebook has done in their recent update is that they have moved all your pixel functions from here to the dataset tab. Facebook has moved all your existing pixels to the dataset tab so that you can actually manage all your pixels from one single place. It's not like the function of the pixel has changed. Just that now, the way the data set work is that you can manage all your assets like your website event, your app event, your messaging event, and your offline event all within the data set tab. Somehow making things less complicated and which means that now you can find all of this in a single location. Also, you can only create a new pixel from the new data set tab. So to get to the data set tab, scroll down and click data set. As you can see here, I already have some old pixels on this Facebook business account and you can see all of them right here. If yours is a new business account or peradventure you have never had a pixel before now, then this section will obviously be empty and then you can go ahead and create a new pixel for yourself from this point. So, to create a new pixel, come here and click the blue add button. Then give your pixel a name and then click create. And once you do, your new pixel will be created and added here. And from here, you can simply select the pixel you want to use and go ahead to use it. So to do that, just select the pixel and then you can add people, you can add partners or you can connect other assets like your Facebook ad to your new pixel that you just created. Also, you can go ahead and add this pixel asset to your website and collect events from your website for your you know, ad activities. For example, to install the MetaPixel on some website like Seller, Shopify and several others, especially the e-commerce website, you will only be required to come here and copy your Pixel ID and paste it in the relevant portion of that website. If there's any of them that you want me to specifically demonstrate for you, then you can let me know in the comment section and I'll do that. But since most people watching this will likely be installing their MetaPixel on their WordPress website, let me quickly show you how to do so on WordPress. To install your newly created Pixel on your WordPress website, come over and click here. So here are the various ways you can use your newly installed Pixel. Here you can set up conversion API, here is where to connect your pixel to your website so you can gather events from people that visit your website and here you can share data from your mobile app. So very quickly, let's say you want to install this pixel on your WordPress website. Just come here and click the Setup MetaPixel. You can use any of these options but let's use the install code manually here. I think that's actually the easiest one. Click this copy button and then your code will be copied to your clipboard. Then head over to your WordPress website dashboard. The easiest way to paste this code on your WordPress is to install a plugin. So come here to the plugin section. So come here and search for a plugin called WP code. Install it, activate it. Once you activate this plugin, then you will see the code snippet function at the function tab of your WordPress website here. So come here and locate header and footer. Then come here and just paste the code we copied from Facebook earlier on. Save changes. Then come back to your meta dashboard here. Continue. Come here and turn on the advanced machine. 
continue and now your pixel is connected to your website and it is active guys it's that simple so this is how to create the meta pixel the new way that facebook has just released so you can now go from here and set up your website pixel event on your website which i will not necessarily be going deep into in this video if you have any question for me let me know in the comment section and i will do my best to answer if you want to see more Facebook ad tutorials, digital marketing and AI videos to make more money this year, then subscribe to this channel and turn on the alert bell so YouTube can notify you when I release my next video. Thank you and I'll see you in the next one.